We're here with Warriors men's head soccer coach Joe Lidke and Matt Bishop, the Warrior of the Week. As we look back on the Warriors last week, 3-1 and one record, and look ahead to this week for the Warriors coach, we'll start with you. Uh, Three-game winning streak over the weekend following a, a tough loss to Beloit on a Tuesday night, but just talk about how your team responded and then the three-game winning streak a little bit. Yeah, I hope that we learn from the tough loss at Ripon and the tough loss at home uh, against Beloit. When you lose one nothing, it's a matter of, uh, of little things at times. So the margin of victory and the margin of defeat can be pretty slim. Uh, and then I was really happy with the way we responded on Friday. We had to put some work in to beat Spalding. I thought that we played really well against Spalding. Um, defensively, we created chances. The scoreline doesn't necessarily reflect, um, I guess, the, how we played against them. And then Saturday against Marion, I think, up to this point, that was our best performance as far as uh, how we kept possession of the ball, how we attacked. I really thought defensively we limited uh, Marion to, um, you know, to just a few half chances here and there. And then to be able to go to Eureka and have everyone play, score some goals, uh, and feel really good about ourselves was a really good way to end a tough stretch of games. Now, Matt, you had a goal in each of the Warriors' wins. You had 11 points last week, four goals, three assists. Uh, th does it seem like the offense seems to be hitting its stride a little bit, uh, things clicking a little bit more, you guys finally getting used to each other? Y yes and no. Um, there's definitely some things we always have to work out and some communication problems, but um, it, it all starts from the back and us defending as a team and winning the ball and just creating chances and finishing them. Now, Coach, you talked about the Marion game a little bit, another big conference game tonight. Uh, you guys host Edgewood. A team who always seems to be in the thick of things as it comes to the conference tournament. Talk about tonight's game uh, for your team. Yeah, Edgewood is huge. Uh, you know, anytime you have a home conference game against a team that is uh, year in and year out, makes a conference tournament, for us that's huge. But we're crawling, or I should say crawling, we're uh, clawing to get into that uh, the mix, that conference tournament mix. So for us this is big, and all of the games for our team are huge. And, and for us it's a matter of coming out and, and wanting it and working hard, uh, and like Matt said, it, it really does start with us, uh, how we defend together as a team. Our defense starts our offense, there's no doubt about it. And Matt, give us give us some keys, some of the things you guys have been working on as, as you go into this big conference game tonight against Edgewood. Um, one of the biggest is definitely our defensive shape and our uh, work rate. Our, uh, our work, rate, work rate is probably one of the best out of a lot of teams, and that's what sets us apart from most of them. Is we we have bigger hearts and we just want it more than them, and uh, we just put it on the field and leave nothing out. All right, once again we're here with uh, Warriors head coach Joe Lidke and Warrior of the Week Matt Bishop. The Warriors host Edgewood tonight at seven o'clock, and the Warriors will also host McMurray on Saturday at three thirty. Thanks for joining us, guys.